Good news today when it comes to getting more Virginians vaccinated against COVID-19. The state is moving up the timetable to get shots in arms. Governor Northam announcing today that everyone 16 and older in the state will be eligible for the vaccine starting April 18th. That's ahead of the May 1st nationwide goal set by the president. Henry Graff with our vaccine team is on your side with everything that you need to know. The hope is that an extra 200,000 J and J vaccine doses will help in this ambitious endeavor, moving up the deadline by a few weeks and opening it up to everyone. Virginia will expand COVID-19 vaccine eligibility to all adults by April 18th. The announcement comes as a lot of health districts around Central Virginia are opening up the people in 1C. That April 18th date is when we will collectively be progressing into phase two. But those in 1A, 1B and 1C and are pre-registered will be scheduled by April 17th. So the state's vaccine coordinator says make sure you are on the list if you are in one of those phase one groups. I think we can confidently make sure that everyone who's in phase one who has pre-registered can be invited into an appointment before it opens up into general eligibility. Dr. Daniel Vula says those still seeking the vaccine will still need to schedule appointments going forward. Ovula also got the Johnson & Johnson one dose shot at Richmond Raceway. I'm going to both be excited about this newfound freedom, but also be, be cautious as, as we move forward until we really see rates of disease start to, tar, start to decrease in our community. Local health districts may open to the general public as early as Monday. Health officials estimate to administer the 100,000th vaccine shot at Richmond Raceway sometime Saturday morning. It really is unclear how often we are going to have to do all this going forward. One study showing the Pfizer vaccine is effective for at least six months at this point in time. Dr. Avula saying in the end, only time will tell as we learn more about COVID. In Henrico, Henry Graff, NBC 12 News. Thanks, Henry.